What's up guys, we're here at the, Chatt the Chattanooga Aquarium. This is part two of the video. If you haven't seen part one yet, I'd really recommend you guys go watch that video before you come and watch this video. But part one was about the, the freshwater aquarium. And now we're gonna be looking at the Chattanooga um, Aquarium in the saltwater um, area. And so it's really cool. There's like sharks and stuff. Stay tuned. There's no rush. Oh, cool. Hey, this is my cousin Colton, he's with me today at the saltwater aquarium, he's also at the freshwater aquarium, and so right now we're inside, we went up uh, two sets of these escalators, and it starts off just like the um, freshwater aquarium, like these, like this rock area, and you go in there, and there's like some things in there, so I'm excited for the saltwater aquarium, and we'll go check it out. It's so cool. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right, so we're coming through this first little like forest rock area, and then the freshwater area where you can touch like the sturgeons. This is like the same kind of thing, but instead it's stingrays. And um, this one right here, I touched it so early. They're slimy. They feel just like fish. Yeah. So we're in this stingray area. We're petting those stingrays right here. There's a horseshoe crab here, and a lot of people think that these things on the end are stingers, they're actually not. And so I've caught one of these in Florida before. They're, you can find them all over. And on the underside, yeah, let's try to flip over here. They have a really cool underside. And so these are really cool creatures, and um, yeah, I've caught them before, they're really cool. And it's like a crab under a shell, and so they protect, they protect themselves that way. And so, yeah, I haven't seen one of those in a long time. All right, we're going into a butterfly room right now. From like the ball butterfly room, we went up an escalator, and now we're here at this penguin exhibit. There's a bunch of penguins in here. <laughs> yeah. So look at these like cool jellyfish. Like they're not actually glowing. But you see there's two big lights on the bottom. And with this little knob, you can like switch in the jellyfish, they like change color. It's so cool. And, and then they're like purple and then you can change it. They like change color. That's so cool. There's more. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna let you take yours, then I'm gonna have, yeah, then I'm gonna get my I gotta get it for a different angle. Oh my gosh. So these giant spider crabs, these are called giant spider crabs, and that's the biggest species of crab. They can get up to 44 pounds, and these are pretty big ones. I don't know how many pounds these ones are, but they're just massive. Oh, 
Alright, so these are the, this is a seahorse aquarium here. And so this was just the jellyfish were over here, and the crabs and jellyfish were over here, so. And the, uh, hold, or the, Oh, Alright, so this is up here. There's a blue spotted tree monitor. Alright, so we're back in this area where there's like a bunch of like animals and lizards and stuff other than fish. So up here we have a panther chameleon. That's like beautiful colors. And down there we have a and down here we have a Madagascar Giant Day Chameleon. Or Gecko, I mean. Madagascar Giant Day Gecko. And then over here there's like some box turtles and stuff. Okay, okay, don't hurt yourself. You guys, look at this cool, it's like a seahorse and it's made out of like old recycle like bottle caps and stuff like that. We're going to keep our way down and look at these other aquariums. Guys, hope you enjoy this part two of the saltwater version of the Chattanooga Aquarium here in Tennessee. And I'll see you guys next time. Make sure to subscribe. And uh, yeah, peace.